How's it going everyone? So in this video, I am gonna do learn how to get rid of ingrown hairs on the neck. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate uh, the support helps my channel grow. Uh, please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. So getting rid of ingrown hairs, you guys, is very simple to do. Um, there's pretty big mistakes that people make in why they're getting ingrown hairs. Don't feel bad though. I used to get ingrown hairs all the time and I've done a ton of research. I've done a, a ton of experimenting with this. I no longer get ingrown hairs. So the first mistake that people make, and I was guilty of this, is when they're shaving their neck, they shave up. Never shave up. Every single shave should be down. So you shave like this every single time down. Don't shave up like this. Don't do that. Shave with the grain, always down. That's why a lot of people who shave their legs, they get ingrown hairs because they shave up. You always shave down. That is the biggest mistake that people make and it is why like 90% of people get ingrown hairs. The second thing that you should do right before you're about to shave is go for a warm shower, not a hot shower, a warm shower. Soften up the neck, make it nice and smooth. By showering with warm water, it actually opens the pores up. It softens the skin. It makes for an easier shave, you guys. That is very important. The third step is to shave with obviously shaving gel. If, if you're not using shaving gel, then start using shaving gel. But the type of shaving gel you should be using is should be for sensitive skin. There are a lot of shaving gels that you get a nice smell from. And that smell is from added ingredients. That's how it gives it that smell. And those added ingredients usually cause irritation to the skin, which can lead to ingrown hairs. So always sensitive skin, shaving gel. The fourth step, and this is super, super common too, is when people are done shaving, they just leave the room, they leave the bathroom. You need to apply something to the neck area when you are done shaving. What that should be is either an aftershave or a moisturizer. Aftershave is basically a moisturizer, but you can do the aftershave or a moisturizer. I use aftershave. So again, like this, this is literally how I shave. I go for a warm shower for 20 minutes. I put my sensitive skin shaving gel on. I then make sure I shave downwards every single time. When I am done, I apply the shaving gel or the moisturizer. That is how you do it. You do this, you'll never get an ingrown hair. End of video. Thank you guys so much for watching.